Good morning class 3. Welcome to the first class of computer. Let's get started with the first chapter. That is computer system. Kids, you can now find a computer system everywhere. If you go to any shop or office, you can find a computer system there. Even kids, you are doing your online classes through a computer, whether through any desktop, laptop, or mobile phone. Let me know which one you are using. Okay. Now, let's know what is a computer. A computer is an electronic device which processes data under program control to generate a meaningful information. You know, kids, when a user feeds any raw data into a computer through any input devices, the brain of the computer, that is central processing unit, processes that raw data and gives a meaningful information through any output devices for just an example when any user feeds 1 plus 1 the computer brain that is cpu accepts it and gives the result as 2 through any output devices now forwarding to the full form of computer okay c c for common o o for operating m m for machine p p for purposely u u for used for t t for technological e e for educational r R for research. Kids, you are now seeing a diagram which is depicting the full form of computer. You just draw it on your class copy and show me. It will help you to learn the full form of computer. Okay. Now, kids, we have lots of body parts. Likewise, computer has. lots of basic parts you can see in the screen monitor cpu speaker keyboard mouse printer everything is a part of computer kids in this picture you can see monitor speaker and a printer these are the output devices okay keyboard and mouse are the input devices and the cpu i have already told you cpu stands for central processing unit this is the brain of the computer always remember what is the brain of the computer that is central processing unit kids just like us computer has also its, its life there is a life living within a computer to run the hardware it requires a software kids in general you can say software is the life within the computer which runs the hardware of the computer hardware are the parts that can be touched or seen but software is the life which cannot be seen but can be feel despite the basic parts shown in the previous slide there are also lots of more hardware for example floppy disk microphone cd drive hard drive etc these are the components of hardware so to run these hardware there needs a program that is called software now let's learn what is a hardware in a detail see you are able to see so, so much of hardware into your computer system a computer hardware is the tangible and physical parts of the computer tangible means which can be seen or touched kids a car is of no use when there is no petrol likewise 
hardware of the computer is of no use without a software as i told you software is that part of the computer which cannot be touched or seen these are the program or you can say set of instructions that is fed inside the computer okay you can see lots of examples of software in your screen for example google gmail youtube all are the types of computer software kids both these two component that is software and hardware are combined to make a complete computer system both are essential without one computer system is incomplete so let's recapitulate what we read today in this class first we have started with the definition of computer then we gone through the full form of computer next is parts of computer after that we read components of a computer that is hardware and software with lots of example now see you can do homework homework is of write down the definition of computer along with its full form kids i have already told you to draw that diagram which was depicting the full form of computer write down the parts of all the computers and what is hardware with some examples and what is software okay kids in the next class we will discuss about the types of software and the relationship between hardware and software okay after that we will start ipo cycle you should also read these two topics before starting the next class till then bye bye and do your homework and show me through the whatsapp group